Look what I made, Rose. That's goofy. I think I should add this wall I made earlier. Wait, I know. <laughs> How about it's a doctor? Hold on, Rose. Hello, Mommy. This is the sheriff. Can I please speak with an adult? Um, this is the sheriff. Hello? Who am I speaking with? This is Harper. I'm the nanny. Is there any other family I can talk to? There's been a horrible car crash and the victims did not survive. I saw a photo with them of two girls and this was the last number dialed belonging to a... Violet. Their only other relative is their Aunt Jenny. I will come by later and speak with the girls and make arrangements. Poor lambs. Uh, girls, uh, something bad has happened to mommy and daddy. Well, if there's nothing else, I'll be on my way. Good luck, girls. I'm sorry for your loss. If you need anything, please, give me a call. Yeah, we'll be fine, thanks. I can only take one of you rats in. I don't want to leave Bee. Oh, you won't be leaving her. She'll be leaving you. No, she's not going to live here in this dump. It's better than foster parents. I hate you! I will get her back. You can't separate us. I already did. Violet, I'd like you to meet your foster parents, Mr. and Mrs. Kruger. Hello, Violet. Nice to meet you, Violet. Welcome to your new home. Hi. This is nice and all, but why can't I just go back to my sister? It's gonna be okay. Mommy, Daddy, where is Violet gonna sleep? In the guest room for now. I'm gonna let you guys get to know each other. If you need anything at all, Violet, don't hesitate to call me. Here's my card. Thank you very much. We'll take good care of her. Frankie, could you please show Violet to her new room? Sure, right this way. How terrible it must be to lose your parents at that age. I can't imagine. Let's just give her some space. Good morning. Good morning. I have some new clothes for you. I hope you like them. Why don't you hurry up and get ready, sweetie, okay? Thanks. New school? Here I come. start our lesson today on division. I'm going to teach you some new vocabulary words as well. Today we'll review what quotients are. You're both late. Ooh. Quiet down. I'm sorry. Okay, take a seat here. Now, let's go back to our chart. You may recognize this from learning multiplication. There's a rumor going around that you abandoned your sister. Is that true? What? Abandoned? Is that what you heard? I can't believe you just said that. I'm sorry. Violet, you'll need a pass.
Auntie Jenny, can you make me some lunch? Auntie Jenny, Auntie Jenny, can you make me some lunch? child I'm sorry Ow clean this up Now So help me understand why did you run out of the classroom I'm sorry sir it won't happen again I promise You know here at the school we we try to respect our teachers I'm just having a really bad day and it isn't easy switching schools all I ask is you do the best that you can, okay? Yes, sir. I'll get on back to class. Miss Tricia, could you walk her back to class, please? Yeah. Hey, I'm sorry I assumed the rumors were true. Before you assume, learn the facts. Before you judge, understand why. And before you hurt someone, think before you speak. You're right. I'm sorry. Hey, sorry about earlier. Can we talk? Is this some kind of prank or something? Because if it is, I'm not in the mood. What do you want? Look, the reason I was being so mean earlier is because it's hard for me to fit in. I'm taller than everyone else, so the kids make fun of me. I hope you understand. Yeah, I, I get it. Why weren't you talking earlier? Well, I just have a lot on my mind. My parents died in a car crash, and I just wish I was able to say goodbye to them. I'm so sorry. I also have a little sister named Rose. I had to leave her with my auntie. She drinks a lot. I'm afraid she has hurt her. If she hasn't yet, she will. No wonder you weren't talking earlier. You do have a lot on your mind. I live with, right now, my foster family, Frankie. They're really nice. If I could just get my sister to come live with us, it would be so much better. Well, that's just it. You have to go get your sister. You're right. I need to go get her. Yeah, she's lost without you, and you're lost without her. Do it tonight, right after school. Yeah, I'll distract our parents. I can't wait to see that stupid look on my aunt's face. <laughs> <laughs> I need a ride. Hi, who's this? I'll tell you on the way. in the stinky place and take you to my foster family. You like them, they're really nice. Get me out of this place. Let's go. Okay, Rose, on the count of three, you run. One, two, three. No, no, I'm here to help. Your principal called me and from what I can tell, he was right. Grab your sister. I'm getting you out of here. Yes! No more evil Auntie Jenny! Is she okay? Yes, She's smiling and jumping. I think she's gonna be okay. <laughs> 